Last year, Governor Charlie gave trainer Bob Baffert and owner Mike Pegram their second Sunland Derby victory. Now they are back for more with the Grey Colt Midnight Hawk, who is by Pegram's hot young sire, Midnight Loot. The Hawk will be back in action just two weeks after a second in the San Felipe Stakes. Baffert also sent Tanma Corporation's Chitu, a winner of two of his three career starts. They're still all lightly raced, so it's a matter of, uh, you know, just keep running. The same thing with, with like Opportunity, who won the Rebel. You know, these, these are horses at this time of year. This is the March Madness for us. We need to, uh, we need to get races in these horses. The two Baffert runners actually raced against each other in February, checking in behind current Santa Anita Derby co-favorite, Candy Boy. Candy Boy, she too on the inside, Midnight Hawk back in third. Candy Boy and she too gonna hit it together. Candy Boy to win it. Now, six weeks later, Barnes sees she too as ready to move forward. You know, you had the two sprint races and then went long for the first time and he had beat me Midnight Hawk in their last race. And uh, I, I see him improving off of that race myself. I think he's really gonna suit this racetrack also. Stakes winner Midnight Hawk is still the most battle tested of the two and Barnes sees a key to better things. He just gotta get the distance a mile and an eighth, you know. He's gotta uh, got kick on a little bit more. He's run into two of the best in California, so taking that into consideration, uh, you know, I think he's all right. Both horses have shown some speed in their races, but Barnes is not too concerned about conflicting styles. I don't see Midnight, Midnight Hawk really being in front of Chitu early. But if he is, you know, so be it. The boys will have to work it out from there. I know we're ready, so, you know, we'll give it our best shot.